Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we are going to discuss the following question and the question says that the floor of a room is 16 feet by 11 feet and its height is 9 feet. Find the distance from a corner point on the floor to the opposite corner on the ceiling. We know that Pythagoras theorem states that in a right angle triangle with hypotenuse C And let A and B we have C square is equal to A square plus B square that is square of length of hypotenuse is equal to sum of squares of length of the legs with this key idea let us proceed to the solution. In this question, we are given a room whose dimensions are 16 feet by 11 feet and height is 9 feet. Shape of room is in a cuboid form whose all corners are at 90 degrees. In this diagram, we have drawn a cuboid with length BD that is 16 feet and width CD that is 11 feet. Height of cuboid AC is given by 9 feet. We have to find the distance from a corner point on the floor to the opposite corner on the ceiling. So, let A be the point on the corner of ceiling and B be the point on the opposite corner on the floor. We join AB and this is the distance we need to find. So, we have point A as the point on the corner of the ceiling. And point B is the point on the opposite corner of the floor. Now, let C be the point on the corner of floor such that triangle ABC is a right angle triangle ABC is a right angle triangle where angle C is 90 degrees. Then we have AC as the height of the room which is equal to 9 feet. And let BC be equal to X feet and AB be equal to Y feet. Now in the figure 
we see that D is one corner of the floor. We also see that points B, C and D form a right angle triangle that is triangle B, C, D is a right angle triangle In triangle BCD, we know that BD is the length of the room and is given as 16 feet. CD is the width of the room and is given as 11 feet and BC is equal to X feet and according to the question we need to find the value of Y that is the distance AB to find the value of Y we need to find the value X first so that we can apply Pythagoras theorem in triangle ABC from the key idea we know that Pythagoras theorem states that in a right angle triangle with hypotenuse C and legs A and B we have C square is equal to A square plus B square so applying Pythagoras theorem in the right angle triangle BCD we say that BC square is equal to BD square plus CD square since we know that triangle BCD is a right angle triangle with angle D at 90 degrees so hypotenuse BC square will be equal to the sum of the squares of the legs CD and BD so we say that BC square that is X square is equal to BD square that is 16 square plus CD square which is equal to 11 square that is x square is equal to 16 square that is 256 plus 11 square that is 121 so we get 256 plus 121 that is 377 so we say that x square is equal to 377 now in triangle ABC I'm applying Pythagoras theorem we say that the hypotenuse AB square will be equal to sum of the squares of the legs of the triangle that is AC square plus BC square and we know that AB is equal to Y so AB square would be Y square is equal to AC square that is 9 square plus BC square which is equal to x square so we get y square is equal to 9 square that is 81 plus x square and we know that x square is equal to 377 so we write 377 and therefore we get y square as 458 that is 
we added 81 and 377 which implies that y is equal to square root of 458 now taking the positive square root of y we get the value of y as 21.4 approximately thus we can say that the distance ab is given by 21.4 feet approximately which is the required answer this completes our session hope you enjoyed this session